Hello crafty friends, it's Erica, Scrapdiva29. Welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on today with a Tuesday morning haul. This is my biggest uh, Tuesday morning haul I've ever done in one day at one store. I was so surprised that I hit the jackpot today. So excited. So I'm gonna jump right in because I have a lot to share with you. I'm gonna start with the paper that I found first and then I'm gonna go into all the other goodies that I found. All right, so the first thing I picked up is this really cute paper um, pack. It's by Lori, Lori Whitlock. It's called Celebrate Spring. This is the cutest little springy paper pad that I've seen. Um, of course, you get 12 uh, sheets and they're all double-sided. Look how cute. That's like one of my favorites. A little birdhouse. Isn't that adorable? Love it. And then I'll just show you a couple in case you haven't seen it. You get this little cute page right here. There's so many cute ones in this one. And then look at that. I love this one right here. Like look at those little um, rain boots and the little um, wheelbarrows. It's just adorable. And then you've got really fun coordinating paper with this kit. It was um, $5.99 in case you were wondering. I love picking up these um, paper kits and then of course you get the, uh, the stickers that come with the kit. So really, really fun, really cute. Happy to find that. My next find is this paper right here by My Mind's Eye and it's called Well Hello. This paper is super thick quality cardstock and you get 12 sheets and there's two of each design and the best part is it was only $2.99. It was only $3 for this all this paper. So I'll show you these really quick. You get hot air balloons and then you get this fun pattern on the back. You get this page right here. And then on the front you have these pretty floral. And then this one is like a pink stripe. And then on the back of it is this adorable cactus page. Super cute. And then you get this page right here. And then look what's on the back. These adorable llamas. They're absolutely adorable. I love it. And then you get this page right here with all the words. And then on the back, you get this little um, like the patterned paper, all the little triangles. And then these adorable, adorable little birdies, super cute. I love the bright, you know, vibrant colors. And then this is the, um, the patterned paper on the back of that one that coordinates. So really fun set for $2.99. Um, I thought that was an excellent deal. So I'm um, going to put that right there. Okay, I did find some chipboard. I found the Good Vibes chipboard. It was $2.99. And I do have the paper collection. I've already made a mini album using this paper collection. Um, I still have some paper left. So um, I can do some more projects. So I'm really excited about that. Really, really fun. I did find the Maggie Holmes um, balloon chipboard. I love this paper. I have the 12 by 12 paper already, but um, I don't have a lot of the embellishments. I think I have a little, but not a lot. So I went ahead and picked this up because I don't think I have it. And it's so pretty. And again, that was $2.99. Moving along, um, I did pick up the Maggie Holmes carousel paper. I love this pad. I just love the glitter that's in it. There's, It's just really, really pretty. So that is why, see, I love that. I love that glitter. It's just so pretty. Pick that up, $6.99. And I did make a mini album with that as well. So you guys, if you haven't seen those uh, mini albums that I've made, make sure you go back and search through my videos so you can uh, see what I created with those papers. Um, I did pick up the Maggie Holmes Bloom. Um, I do own this paper pad, but I decided to pick it up again because I love this page right here. The bows. It's like, this is probably like my favorite page in the entire collection. And then I love this, this little black, like floral with the pink. It's just so pretty. This is just a gorgeous paper collection. So I was really happy to um, find that again. All right, moving along, I did find some dies. I found this Spellbinders die. It was, excuse me, it was $9.99. I thought it was a little pricey for a die at Tuesday morning but it makes a really cute um, paper bag. Um, little, uh, it's like a paper, paper bag. So it's like a little treat bag and it's really, really fun. Um, I'll show you what it looks like. The dies look like this. It's very similar to the one from uh, 
stamping up except for it's um, longer in length and it's like um, not as wide as the what that one and that one is really expensive and I have that one But um, I'm really glad I picked it up because it's really cute Let me show you what it looks like because I had to make a quick project for you guys Look how cute this bag is so I went ahead and I used I think this is the chasing dreams paper and um, I did a little shaker on the little front and this is a tag from the paper collection I used some chipboard from the collection. I used that really pretty ribbon I just recently picked up from Hobby Lobby. I did not do a ribbon haul because I didn't think you guys wanted to see my haul again, my ribbon haul. So um, I had found that at uh, Hobby Lobby in case you're wondering. It has those tiny little sequin flowers on it. It's absolutely gorgeous. I had received Happy Mail from Breanne and she had used that in some of her projects and I was hunting that ribbon down. So I was really, really happy to have found it. Look at all the sequins I put in there and I did use some pretty polka dot um, tool that I think I picked up at Hobby Lobby as well. And this is what it looks like. And then I, this is one of the tassels that I made um, with those beads I picked up from Michaels and I think it came out super cute. And look at this tiny little bow, isn't that precious? I did pick these up off of AliExpress in case you're wondering. I'll link, um, I'll leave the link down below if you wanna try to hunt them down. I believe I got them in <laughs> several different colors, but this one is purple, but I think they do have other colors in case you're wondering, but I really love my little tassel that I made. And there you have a super cute treat bag, and this is what the back looks like. So I love it, and in case you're wondering, I have my little ruler right here so I can measure it for you. Let's see how uh, long this is. So this is about five and a quarter inches long, and it is three and a quarter inches in the width. So uh, it's a good size. You can put some treats in here um, and slide it behind the pocket. And you probably could make the gussets bigger if you wanted to. Um, but I think it's so super cute. I'm really happy that I picked it up. So that is that die right there. Um, I did find a bow bunny die and it looks like this. It's a Polaroid shaker and it has a super cute little heart cut out. It has the word hello and then these cute little arrows and then like a little film strip. Absolutely adorable. It was $5.99. And that's the code in case you want to hunt that down. Absolutely love this die. So happy I found it. Um, I did cut it out so you guys could see what it looks like. It does look like this cut out. And I just did it in pink and then in the uh, pattern paper. But that hello is super cute. And then of course you could, uh, you know, you have the cut apart that comes out right there, and then you would have your little heart where you could do some fun things with the Polaroid. Obviously, you can make a shaker. And this is what the smaller one looks like. It has the and sign, really, really cute. And then this is the little strip of paper that it cuts out, like the little movie strip. So really, really, really fun die. I'm so happy I found that one. All right, moving along. Let me move some stuff over. All right, so I did find a bunch of the chipboard. Yes, this is 50 die cuts and this is the confetti collection. It has all of those images inside this little box. And so this will go with all of the Maggie Holmes paper that I have. Um, I also picked up this one right here. And this is the, I believe the bloom. And yes, this is the bloom. It goes with the bloom paper, and I love these die cuts in here, super pretty. Um, I found um, the gather, and it looks like this. And you get 40 different pieces of ephemera in this little package. And as you can see, it's a great price. You know, you're not breaking the bank, $2.49, so yes, love it. Um, I was able to find the embellishments with the little pom-poms and the sequence, so super, super cute, and that was $1.99. I did find um, the rhinestones, and I was hoping I was gonna find these, and these are so pretty. I love those bows, they're so gorgeous. Um, I did find uh, this floral ephemera pack, and I believe I have one in my stash, but now I have a backup. <laughs> Look at all the flowers that you can you know, use on your projects. You get so many, you get 102. And then the fun part about it is it's vellum. Some of them are vellum and then some of them are just the cardstock so you can do some fun layering. And that was 249. dollars 
So really great price. And then I found the open book and it looks like this. And again, you get 81 pieces in this one. Wow, you get a lot in this one. So this is pretty. And these are all of the pieces that come inside of the open book in case you don't know. All right, moving along. Let's see, what else did I get? I have a few more things to share. I did find the um, Jen Hadfield, and these are some really cute tags. And it says, thinking of you, and then um, you get all of these different ones. Um, happy day, welcome home, a gift for you, hello friend. And I just figured these would be really cute to like stick in happy mail or gift you know, some to some friends. Really, really pretty. There's a better picture of all the tags you get in this little kit called Along the Way. Adorable. And I did find this Maggie Holmes embellishment kit. You get some little um, ephemera and flowers. And I really love the uh, gold hearts, if you can see them. I don't know if you can see them. There's some little gold hearts in there that are absolutely adorable. And if I would have noticed that in the store, I probably would have picked up another one because <laughs> they actually had two in the store. But I just picked up one. I was trying to be good. Super, super cute. Um, I found these really cute enamel dots. They were 219. They have butterflies, hearts, and then they have the circles and flowers and stars. So like there's a mix of um, enamel dots and this was pink paisley. Um, I did find some Maggie Holmes stamps. I found this one right here. And again, all the stamps were $2.99. So really cute. I really love the little ice cream cone stamp right here. And then the tag is covering it up, but that one says ice cream, something, happiness, really fun. So I'm so happy I found that one. I found this one right here, it says more sunshine and flowers. And again, these are all $2.99. Um, I did find this one, and this one says hashtag blessed. I especially love that one right there. And I really like the music notes too. So yay for that one. And then I also found this one and I really like the fact that you can stamp the little sentiments in these and these. And then I was thinking I could stamp them and then use my brother's scan and cut and um, you know, cut them out. That would be really fun. So really, really pretty. I'm so happy I found all of those. Um, I did find this Jan Hadfield. It's called Homemade. They're dimensional stickers. And I just love these. They're just really cute. I can see myself popping them on a card or just like to send out like a quick thank you. I always have neighbors close by that help me out and pick up my kids from school sometimes when I have to go to doctor's appointments for my daughter. And um, this is just going to be really simple to send out some quick little thank yous. So I, was, I, I really like this and it was $1.99. And you see the little example? That's really cute, the little wreath. Adorable, right? All right, moving along, I found some stickers. These are the Maggie Holmes, and I have these, and I used them already, that's why I picked them up again. I actually did use them in my mini album that I created, so I wanted to get some more, so I was happy I found them, and they were $1.99. Um, I picked up some more of these. I already own them, but I wanted to get one more. I love these little tickets right here. And this is just a really fun one, and it was only $1.49. Um, I found these thicker stickers, and it says good times, fun, OMG. And it's like rose gold, and it's just really fun. I love, I love all the little... So a cute set right here. Moving along, I found this sticker set right here, and I think this goes with the Chasing Dreams. I really love these little stickers down here, and I can't wait to play with this collection. And it was only $2.19 and you get a front and a back and you get a fun little alpha set, uh, alpha set with it. So really, really cute. Um, I did find this one as well, another Maggie Holmes uh, sticker set and I love the My Heart is Full. So cute. I mean, seriously. And then you get all these cute little words down here. They're all stickers and um, you get tickets and flowers and another alpha and this one is in black with the gold. Really pretty. Um, I found these thicker stickers. They're whimsical. And I haven't seen this before, but I just thought this would be so fun to do like a fun crafty project for a friend. Like make something fun like Happy Mail because that's the scissors and the glue and the ruler and a little banner. So really, really fun set. Love this one. And that was $1.99. 
Um, I found this one right here, and this is just a lot of different words. It kind of looks like it will go with the Maggie Holmes, uh, so that's why I picked it up. Really fun. I love you. I love all those little banners. Super cute. Love the colors. That'll go perfect with the Maggie Holmes paper. And I picked up this one as well, and these were $2.49. And I'm pretty sure they go with the Maggie Holmes collection. Yeah, love Bloom, definitely. <laughs> oh my goodness. So yes, I'm so excited. And then I found these really cute um, thickers. They're tiny, but they're glitter. And um, I thought those were really fun. So I picked a set of those up. They always have thicker stickers um, there. All right, I'm almost done. I found the uh, Maggie Holmes uh, carousel stickers. Um, so I can play with these. They were $1.99 and you get three sheets, which is really nice. Or it looks like, yeah, three. Really cute. And then I found these two stickers. It says Dream and then I Love You. And I just love these stickers. They're so pretty. So that was a really fun find. Um, I did find the Good Vibes um, frames and you get four in the package and I love that glitter. It's so pretty. So yes, I can't wait to make another project with that. And then I found the crepe paper. Um, these are six cards. They look like this. And again, they were $2.49. And look at that. It has like a little window. Look at the cute little Ferris wheel. And then you get um, the um, swan. And then this little pocket right here. And then you get that page with the cute little um, carousel with the horse. So really, really fun. And then I also found the Maggie Holmes washi tape. And look how cute, it has the bows in there. And this just goes with the, I think the Chasing Dreams collection. But um, super cute, love it. And then um, I was lucky to find this ephemera pack right here with these big um, embellishments and words. You get 44 in here. And these are all of the embellishments that come in here. This goes to the confetti paper. But obviously you can mix and match because a lot of the Maggie Holmes paper um, are very similar in color and uh, so it's easy to like mix and match I think so really really cute and then last but not least <laughs> I found these adorable brads they are a dollar 49 they're by American Crafts and I just loved love them I've never seen any brads like this before um, yeah, they're really pretty. So that is my massive Tuesday morning haul. Thanks for stopping by my channel today. Please leave me a comment and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.